All right, so you might be wondering what could possibly be better than three stand-up jet skis. What about four stand-up jet skis? All right, so we got the new Super Jet in, and it looks freaking killer. We just got it set up with the numbers, so we're all ready for the water. But we got plenty of mods to do on her. So we got our mods already waiting. We've had a bunch of them for several months now. But we got the uh, uh, exhaust tube. This uh, we wanted to get to clean up the engine bay some. And we don't think it'll interfere with the uh, factory ECU enough that it'll affect the tuning and require tuning. So we're not looking to do the tuning on the ECU. So this will make it sound a little bit louder and clean up the engine bay. So we're excited to put that on. And then we've got the uh, Riva Racing intake rate. This one we specifically got, not because it was either the most aggressive or anything, nothing like that. We got it purposely just for the fit and finish because uh, a lot of the ones that we've had for our old Super Jets uh, and the Kawasaki, um, a, a lot of the ones that we've tried, they don't have a good fit. So we end up having to file it down and requires some customization to get it to fit properly in the spot for the intake rate. So with this one, we've read that it fits perfectly. So we're excited to put that on. And then we have the handle pull spring, which is a necessity for pretty much every ski. It's like one of the first things we always do to lighten up the handle pull. So you have less uh, fatigue while you're riding. And with this one, uh, it feels pretty light, but our goal is to keep it as light as possible or feel as light as possible. So I think it'll help some. And we'll be excited, interested to try this because I have read that some people have issues with this. So it'd be interesting to see how, how easy of an install it is. And then we're going to be doing handlebars. So we got some grips to throw on there, but uh, we'll be ordering handlebars here soon. Get that on there. And then we have the Yamaha, uh, factory Yamaha bag. And I think we got this just because we were all excited about the new ski and wanted to get some more goodies for it. But uh, uh, we'll let you know if we actually like this or not. Uh, Cause right now it's kind of in between with the, it interfering with the, coming close to the lock here. And uh, this might interfere with the gasket on the hood. So we'll figure that out and let you know if we actually end up keeping this on there. And then eventually we will be doing the uh, Hydro Turf mat or the uh, Jet Trim mat because uh, this is always uh, hard on your elbows when you're climbing onto the ski. So that'll probably be one of our, we'll do that one pretty soon.